Hello. Madam, I'm sorry to inform you, but your loan is not approved. Rejected? Again? Why is it not approved? Well, according to our records, you have a very poor credit score. Credit score? Poor? Wait, what is credit score? What is a credit score? This is a three-digit number based on a level analysis of your credit files to represent your credit worthiness. It's basically an indication of how financially capable you are to repay your debt. But why is it important? This report is used by banks and lenders to determine how risky it will be to approve your credit card and loan. Now, if your credit score is high, that means you are more likely to get the banks to approve your credit card and loan applications. That's why it's very important to have a good credit score as it's a good indicator to the banks of your financial health. So how do you maintain a good credit score and still win in life? Firstly, a credit score is not just something for the banks to see. You can also take a look at your own credit score. Now, most banks determine the credit worthiness of an individual by obtaining more than one credit report from credit agencies like CETOS, Ramsey and the Credit Bureau of Malaysia. Meanwhile, Bank Negara Malaysia manages Secrets. This is a database of all Malaysians' credit reports. And this report contains details such as any outstanding credit, credit card or loan applications and your repayment history. Like a credit score, you can obtain your own secrets report. Okay, so how do I get a healthy credit score? Once you've got your report, let's get started on how to build a healthy credit score. Now, the most important thing you need to do is to pay your bills on time. This can be anything from your credit card statements to your utility bills or even your monthly loan repayments. Doing this will indicate that you are being financially responsible and it will help you build a positive credit score over time. Credit cards are a great tool to help you build your credit score. Prudent spending and punctual payments of your monthly statements will once again show that you are a financially responsible individual. While you're at it, make sure that you use the right credit cards for you. Because if you're building your credit history, why not use credit cards that give you cash back? Yeah, that's a win-win situation right there. Finally, and we've mentioned this a couple of times before, start an emergency fund. You see, having an emergency fund will make sure that should you run out of a source of income for a while, at least you still have some cash to keep up with your monthly commitments. Here's a pro tip. Set aside at least 10% of your income and put that into your emergency fund. And then build that fund until you save at least 3 months worth of your salary. That way, you'll have a nice financial cushion. Want to know more about getting a good credit score and how to do it the easy way? Head on to ringgitplus.com.